Hey y'all, welcome back to Vlogmas. Is this gonna work? Hello. Okay, so I we're just jumping right into it. Me and Morgan just got ready, like barely. Um, I put on a little bit of makeup. My hair, I just brushed it. This is curls from yesterday. Uh, this, I should probably roll this side. Um, this flannel's from American Eagle. Um, from 2019, actually. I don't know if they'll still have it. Um, this was me and Morgan's first Christmas. We went shopping with his like mom and sister. And I picked out a couple things at American Eagle and then he bought them all. So sweet. So it was like the first fit Morgan bought me. Uh, just black leggings and some tall socks and white sneakers. That's the fit. It's Saturday. We're going out to lunch to our favorite Mexican restaurant. They also do, okay, can y'all see these three pictures? Probably not. All of these are the same. They do these free photos on Saturdays. And we only have three on the fridge, but we probably have six total. And they are probably gonna give us another one today. So I'll update you. But this is, I saw this on TikTok. It's like viral right now. Mary Ruth's Liquid Morning Multivitamin Essentials Plus. It's the strawberry flavor. It says non-GMO, vegan, dairy-free, gluten-free, zero fat, sugar-free, family-friendly. May support energy, beauty, immunity. So the reason I bought this, I haven't opened it yet. And I think, yeah, refrigerate after opening. Um... Where's my cup? I don't know what that means. Anyways, it has lots of, you know, vitamins and all of that kind of stuff. Um, you do one to two tablespoons, energy, beauty, good up to six months. It's got lots of, hey, excuse me, vitamin A, vitamin C, D3, E, like, biotin b12 folate zinc like a ton of stuff hutchie can we not do this right now say hello vlogmas you want some mary ruth's sweet boy so we're gonna give it a go it's uh the girl who i saw it from originally said that this is like life-changing and it gives her so much energy so like it's not jittery, but like I don't get the 2 p.m. slump at work. Like it has changed the game for her. So that is why I bought it to add to my morning routine. And I will let you guys know in 30 days if I think it works. But let me grab a little shot glass and we'll take some. Okay, kind of just guessing. I don't know how many teaspoons are in a tablespoon. That's one teaspoon. Oops, two. Three. We're gonna do three teaspoons today. This is what it looks like. I'm kind of nervous. It smells really, it's like good, but a little bit weird. So strawberry flavor, here we go. Oh yeah, it tastes like juice. Totally fine, like thick juice, but juice. Love it. So I'll let you guys know if I notice any um, benefits, but a lot of people commented about this brand and how good it is. They offer a lot of stuff. They even have a nighttime one. Um, they have a, like a ton of stuff. So I'm going to put this in the fridge and we're going to head to lunch. Also, before we go, I wanted to share my newest package from Ana Luisa. They are sponsoring today's video. So thank you to them, but I've talked about them for years. I wear their jewelry constantly. This little gold piece is from them. I'm obsessed with it. I got it years ago and I wear it every day and it's still in like perfect condition and I just paired it with a silver ring I already had. So gorgeous. But I got, um, and they changed their little packaging. How cute are these little jewelry bags? These are really good quality. This one's like a canvas almost. Um, and they just, everything comes packaged in these little things. How freaking cute. Um, they did give me a discount code, so I'll leave it right here for you. But I got this little set of chains. I might put these on right now, actually. Hachi, Hachi loves Anna Luisa. Then I got this set for my sister for Christmas. They're little earrings and they have butterflies. Like, are you kidding? So cute. She loves butterflies. She has multiple piercings. So this is going to be so cute in a little ear stack. Love that. I also got this ring. I love dainty rings and I'm obsessed with this one. It has like a little, it's kind of like a chain. I love it. Um, and I might replace it actually with this silver one that I never take off. So we'll see if I can get it off. Can't get it off, it's fine. <laughs> but like, I'm obsessed. How pretty is that? And then the last thing that I got, 
are these cutest hoops ever with like the dots. Actually, I might change out of these earrings and go ahead and put these in because they are so, so stunning. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in this new hoop. I'm really obsessed with these. I'm a like sucker for just a cute gold hoop. I wear them pretty much every day of some kind. And like, these are just so stunning. I love. So you can use my code, Hutchie, you hear this? You can use my code LouiseLane20 for 20% off your order. Check it out. Get some gifts. Grab something for yourself. Grab something for a friend and maybe a family member. This is also such a cute, you could like put it on a little ornament and hang it on the tree as a gift. You could put it in someone's stocking. I love these. Like, so pretty. These are such a good everyday hoop. So use my code to get a little discount and I'll leave that and the link down for you in the description box. So I'm about to make a like hash brown egg casserole. I've never made one like this before, um, but this is just a little, I think this is a seven by 11 or something like that pan. Um, I have it greased with a little olive oil and I found this on Pinterest, so I'll link it down below. But you start by layering your hash browns and then you add some cheese and like whatever protein. I just um, cut up some of these I put them in the microwave quickly so I could cut them. Turkey sausage patties, I did six. So I cut those up and then I did about a third of a block, um, maybe a, almost half of a block of sharp cheddar. Put that on there. I'm gonna dice up some of these jalapeno slices to mix in it. And then I have nine eggs with some garlic pepper. And it does say to add, um, I think like a cup of milk, which I'm not gonna do a cup, but I will do just a splash just to make it creamy. And I'm gonna whisk that up and you'll see it come all together. Hopefully it's good. Oh, and I have some frozen spinach I'm gonna throw in there as well. All right, y'all, I'm still drinking my coffee. This is my second cup. Um, these are delicious. Just wanted to update. I'm obsessed. Okay, I don't know what is under my nail, sorry. Um, I'm obsessed with these. Delicious. They're just like little cookies. They're not overly sweet, but they are like sweet enough, if that makes sense. They're super soft. I love, this is going to be something on my grocery list every single week. They are a little expensive. They're like $6. Um, 
and you can have two for um, about 90 calories. So I'm gonna have one of these. We're still waiting on that casserole. It just is taking forever for the eggs to cook through um, and I'm literally starved. So I'm gonna have this. Okay, egg casserole is done. I'm not gonna lie, that took almost an hour for the eggs in the middle to set. Um, I love egg casseroles like this, but they always take so long and I forget how long they take for like the middle to cook. But anyways, worth the wait. Look how amazing. I am so excited to give this a try. So we're just gonna let it cool for about 10 minutes and then we'll dig in. I'm kind of hungry. It's 3.30, so I'm gonna have a light and fit Greek yogurt. This is my favorite one. Um, the strawberry cheesecake, 80 calories, 12 grams of protein. So pretty good for a snack. I'm just gonna dump that in the bowl. gonna have grilled cheese and soup later so I've pre-tracked that and I still have like 300 calories left so I'm gonna have this trying to keep it low calories so I can have some dessert later <clears throat> this is just pineapple obviously that I haven't got into yet, so. I think I probably should have sliced it a little smaller. Mmm, it's so good. Okay, I'll get a couple more pieces because that's like really good. Mm, 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 mm. And I'm just gonna add a little of this granola. So it's just like a random one from Walmart. Um, granola, pretty high, obviously, in calories, but I'm just gonna do like a tablespoon because this isn't a very, um, I do like, it's not a very big bowl of yogurt. So it's not like you need a ton. And that is afternoon snack. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna prep some chicken for the week just for some dinners. Morgan's gonna go out of town, so this will be handy for me to just come home and already have dinner pretty much ready. I just have to assemble it. So I'm using one of the Costco um, like chicken breast packages. So got that into the crock pot. I'm gonna add some Taco Bell taco seasoning or whatever kind you like, and just a little bit of salsa for some moisture. So I'm gonna use this one because it's just what we had in the pantry. It does say it's hot, so I'm a little bit worried. I'm not gonna add too much, just a little bit. Um, and then I also am buying some pico from the store and I'm gonna mix that in with it tomorrow because that's when my grocery pickup is. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna have some easy chicken tacos for the week. All right, y'all, I'm about to make a grilled cheese with soup. So this is the one that Morgan loves. So I got two of those, um, one for each of us, but he's not ready to eat. So 280 per cup, 500 per container. Um, that actually works because these are pretty like rich. I never finish it. I always give the leftover to Morgan. So we'll see, but I have tracked um, a cup of that, two of the craft singles. I know this is like not good quality, but it works so beautifully with grilled cheese. So that's what we're using. Also the Hillshire Farm Ultra Thin Turkey, two slices of the Sara Lee 45 calorie bread, some light mayo for the outside and the inside. I don't know. Some people might think that's gross. Actually, I know a lot of people think that's gross, but I love mayo on my grilled cheese, like on the inside. Obsessed. I am a grilled cheese master. Okay, probably should have cut it, um, but didn't. Look how beautiful, amazing. Got the soup, having a sparkling water, and just watching some YouTube. And I love it in here, it has such a good vibe. And then there's Chance, hoping he'll get some. <laughs> okay, so the chicken is done. I just shredded it up and tasted it. I was worried I overcooked it, but it actually tastes good, so. 
I mean, obviously it tastes good, but I don't think it's overcooked. So yay. Actually, I'm going to wait and let this cool off a little bit before I put it in the fridge. But that is for this week when Morgan leaves. Tomorrow I'm going to be cooking some ground turkey for a dinner for the two of us. Um, we did all the dishes. So this is just the crock pot and the two forks I just used. Um, I'm going to go take a shower. I've hardly shown my face today and we can all see why. Um, I'm going to go take a shower, um, whiten my teeth, do all the things um, that we do on Sundays. And <clears throat> then I'm going to come back, put that chicken away, wash that last dish. I have my new, one of my new candles burning. This one's from Target. Like how cute is this little tin? I'm obsessed. But it's been burning for a couple of hours, so... I'm going to put that one out. I'm going to turn this one off. Mm -hmm. And just let the crock pot cool and sit with some soap while I shower. But I think that's the end of today's vlogmas. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you in the next one.